Who says you need ice to have a bobsleigh race? Not the people of the tiny historic German town of Hückeswagen, where for the fourth time they held a summer bobsleigh competition. The steep cobbled main street converted into a bob run, allowing thousands of fans to line the track and watch international athletes from 10 nations perform at close quarters. Going into the final runs for the women, Belgium's Elfie Willemsen lay joint second with breakwoman Annelies Holthoff. The competition decided by the best three results from four runs held over two days. The women's race so close that any slip could mean disappointment. It was a fast run for the Belgian bullets, but would it be fast enough? Tied with Elfie after three runs, Esme Campus. Shaving the walls, the Dutch driver who recently announced her retirement from professional sliding went 1.6 seconds quicker with her breakwoman Sanna Decker. The standard two-man sleds run on wheels like inline skates instead of normal runners, but they are just as hard to control as their ice-bound cousins. <laughs> Germany's Anja Schneiderheinzer had been fastest in all three preceding runs and with breakwoman Lisette Turner set another fastest start. The 2006 Olympic champion sealed a popular home win as they came down the course another half second quicker than the Dutch. Fantastic result for Germany's Anja Schneiderheinzer. The slow motion shows just how much steering effort is required to get these sleds down the narrow track. Schneider Heinz are coming out comfortably on top. In the men's competition, Russia's Alexander Kazyanov battled for third with America's multiple Olympic and world champion Stephen Holcomb going into the final runs. Kazyanov and brakeman Vladimir Zaitsev ended up tied with Holcomb and Justin Olsen completely equal. But having set the fastest individual time, the Russian was given the nod in third place. The organizers decided, however, not to split the Russians and the Americans and put them both on the third step on the podium. Swiss legend Bayard Hefty set the fastest start time with Alex Bauman. And he laid down a smoking final run to challenge for the top spot. The multiple European champion rattling the barriers as he tried to chase down victory. Hefty showing his skill summer and winter rubbing down the wall, looking for the fastest time. A quarter of a second slower in the push, Dutch pairing Edwin van Kalke and Jurian Veselink knew they had a battle on their hands, but a fantastic drive by Edwin handed them the winner's prize. Second in the final run was all they needed to beat Bert Hefty to the top step of the podium. And look how hard they had to push, clattering across the finish line to take it by one single point. The end of a great weekend of entertainment for athletes and fans, just what's needed with only 14 weeks until the World Cup season begins.